Hi, good morning. Josh Barker with Remax Town and Country Real Estate. And thank you for checking out our video blog for the month of July. You know, this month I wanted to touch base on four separate topics that I think are some of the hottest topics that people are asking me about here in a local market. The first one just starts off with home inventory. A lot of buyers are noticing that there are more and more homes to choose from. And this is causing two things to take place. One is that the home shopping period for the average buyer is now beginning to extend. And the largest reason for that is there's a lot more homes to look at and it's taking longer for a buyer to feel comfortable with the market in order for them to make a decision and purchase a home. So that's one piece that we're seeing right now with the home inventory growing. The second piece of home inventory growing is that we're beginning to see more and more price reductions. Now, I don't want to alarm anybody. We're not seeing sales prices go down, but we are seeing um, list prices begin to decline down to the point of where most recent sold prices were, which simply means that our market is most likely is not going to be appreciating very much for the remainder of this year. The second piece I want to just to talk about briefly is just interest rates. Interest rates are trending up and most experts agree that interest rates can be well into the 5% range by this time next year. So for anybody that's thinking about buying a home in the next couple of months, just keep this in mind. The sooner you buy a home, it's most likely that the cost associated with owning that home will not be any lower than it's going to be if you do it soon. So keep that part in mind. Next piece, just talking about with pending home sales. Our pending home sales here locally and nationally are certainly going down. Now part of that is because we really in the last couple of years have been selling a lot of homes to what we call backlog of buyers. This is buyers that were waiting to get into the market a few years ago but didn't want to until they knew prices were not going down and starting to go up. Well, over the last few years, we've been selling a lot of properties to those particular buyers, and it's completely understandable that we're now starting to see our pendings go down slightly because we're not trying to sell off that same backlog of buyers we had just a few years ago. So that's just something to keep in mind. Now, the last topic I wanted to touch base on is just home appreciation going forward. You know, I went and took the time to go through all the experts and just looked at about 15 different economists to get an idea of what most people are saying for appreciation. And for the remainder of this year, most experts agree that 2014 will be a 3 to 4% appreciation for the remainder of the year. Going into next year, depending on how high interest rates go, we may only see just a few percentage points in appreciation as well. So um, in any case, take a look at the blog. We've got a lot of information regarding these topics I went over with you today. And if you have any questions, feel free to give us a call. We realize it's summer. A lot of people that are thinking about getting sold before the end of the year are running out of time. So if you need anything, if you have any questions about the value of your home, make sure to give us a call. We'll help you out. Okay? Thanks again for your time. Make it a great day.